Hey, Facebook family, it's Chris Sizemore. It is Sunday, December 6th, I think. I wanted to just shoot a quick video and let you know how I'm doing with my Zen Project 8 challenge. So just let you know kind of what's going on with me and, you know, kind of some of the everyday struggles that people face, you know, when they're trying to make life changes like this. Um, today, you know, it's a beautiful day outside, so I'm actually walking um, at the high school where my kids are having their basketball pictures taken today and they're actually fixing to have a basketball game you know but instead of me sitting around while they're doing that normally like I normally would you know just probably playing on my phone or something I actually just thought you know I'm gonna go outside and just walk for 30 minutes get some exercise in you know so and it just it reminded me of a post that I saw today from a really good friend um, Sharon Joala where she was basically just trying to say that you know when you're making changes like this or trying to make um, a life change you know little things add up which is true you know, so just like now, instead of me sitting there, you know, for 30 minutes to an hour doing nothing, I can make a choice to come outside and walk for 30 minutes. It's a beautiful day outside. I mean, it is an amazing day outside. And this is actually going to be kind of fun. And I get to talk to you guys real quick. So um, another thing that I had said, you know, little things that you can do um, just for some tips, I guess, is just, you know, that I'm trying to start to, to implement in my own life is, you know, parking in the back of a parking lot. You know, that's extra, some extra steps you can get in, extra walking. Also, at work, I've been trying to take the, the um, stairs instead of the elevator. You know, that, that's a big deal. You know, when I'm on the fourth floor, you know, and I have to do that a couple times a day, you know, that adds up and that's some good exercise. Also, when I get off of the subway in downtown, you know, I don't use the escalators, I use the stairs. So I think that's been helping a lot. But I also wanted to just keep things real with you guys. Like this weekend, this has been a really hard weekend for me. Uh, sorry, I'm out of breath a little bit, um, but it's been a tough weekend. You know, I had my company Christmas party on Friday night. We had an amazing event where we were at Top Golf, and you know they had a um, buffet open, an open bar, and it was a lot of fun. And I didn't screw up completely with food. You know, they had some really good grilled vegetables, and I tried to stick to a lot of the vegetables and a lot of the salad. Um, but you know, I did have some drinks that I normally, you know, probably wouldn't have because I'm trying to really cut back on that while I'm doing this. But I, you know, I did. But, you know, me and Tracy, we walked around downtown Atlanta a lot that night. So we probably got in an extra two miles for sure. You know, so I didn't feel too bad about it. But then on Saturday, one of my friends got married and they had an amazing wedding. I mean, it was beautiful. The setting was beautiful, but they had an amazing, like, dinner afterwards. I definitely ate more than I should have. Again, I didn't, I didn't totally screw up, but I definitely ate way more than I was supposed to. But I had chicken. I had tried to get a lot of salad and a lot of the vegetables. But again, they had an open bar, so I had some drinks, you know, that I'm trying not to do. And I definitely had some wedding cake. I did only eat half of the wedding cake, so I was proud of myself for that. But, you know, you're going to run into situations every now and then that's going to be hard. And, you know, you just, you have to just take it with stride and don't beat yourself up about it, I guess is what I, what I really want to get across. Because normally... This would, you know, defeat me. I would feel like, you know what, I already screwed up. Whatever, I'm just going to keep eating, you know. And today's Sunday, I, it's still the weekend, so I'm just going to keep on eating. Whatever, I'll start again on Monday. And you know what, I didn't do that today. I got up this morning, I took my Zen Pro shake, and today I'm getting in more exercise. I'm walking when I could be sitting. So I'm not going to let it defeat me this time. And I really feel good about it. And I'm not going to beat myself up either. You know what, I did have a little setback at these parties. But you know what, it's December, I'm gonna probably have more parties. And as long as I keep going, you know, and trying to make the best choices I can most of the time, I'm still gonna be successful. So I just wanna let you guys know that, you know, if you're struggling with this, just like I am, just just start again. Don't, don't beat yourself up, don't stop, don't quit. Just make the best choices that you can as often as you can. All right, so hope you guys have a great Sunday. I really appreciate all the support that I'm getting. Thank you for watching my videos and thank you for the feedback and the comments that I get because it really means a lot. So just hope you guys, again, have a really good Sunday night and a good week this week. I will talk to you guys later. If you want information on uh, what I do, just message me and I will get back with you and I can um, definitely try to help. All right, talk to you guys later. Bye.